Hello friends, I am Durgesh Sahani and we are creating series of video tutorial for super global variables in PHP. So in this tutorial we are going to learn post method. Uh, if the form method is post then how we can access these values onto the other forms. So, uh, the next super global variable is dollar underscore post. So we are going to see this one. So suppose we have this form. We have this form and I'm going to make the changes into the same file. So suppose here method is post. Okay. And here we have some values like I'm going to create one more for uh, one more field here name and mobile like this. We have two values. So here I'm using br tag here also we are using br tag and if we refresh this web page we are getting this and we, now we are going to send this same same file xs.php but now this time method is post so if we are going to run this program the same as same like so if you are writing anything here and we are sending it so see we are not able to see the value here right so if you if there is no value we are not able to access uh, that value with the help of dollar underscore get what we have here so we have to change it with dollar underscore post so the here the difference between dollar underscore uh, uh, get and post method is get always send value into the url parameters it's always send values from this section or you can say get method always send values from header section okay if you see this browser so brow this line is dividing your browser into two parts first one is header section and second one is document section so get method always send your values for through header sections and post method always send your values from this document section that's why it is not visible to user another difference you can say as it is uh, visible inside the URL, so it is uh, if somebody uh, stand beside behind you, so he can uh, easily access see uh, your values, what you are sending, and and all. So there is this concept of security. You can say security concern. Then third, uh, you can say uh, in URL parameters, you can send limited amount of data. And uh, in post method, you can send huge amount of data. Uh, another example you can say uh, difference you can say in get method you can send only textual type of data whereas in post method you can send uh, any type of data like images and all you can send uh, attachments you can send with the help of post method so we will see uh, that concept also so let's uh, see how to access the post method values so suppose we want to access this value this form value into here okay so what we are going to do here uh, we are going to use post sorry capital letter post here also we have to use post and we have one more values here uh, let's do it like this name And here we are going to use we are writing mobile and here also mobile so, uh, one more thing when we can do here uh, we can check one more condition if uh, okay let it we will provide these values so see One minute. post okay. refresh this web page and I am writing here my name and numbers suppose we are writing this number 10 digit number just click on submit button as you can see we are we are getting name okay e name and mobile 
oh sorry <laughs> we have to change the name of second as we have, we have copy and paste directly so you are right just write up right mobile okay second name is mobile now again uh, refresh value 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 see we are able to access this value these values and the mobile number so you can practice it, it with uh, just providing uh, you can create this form like registration form and you can send this value to another form just access those values and you can store it into the database or whatever you want to do so this is a very simple example of uh, accessing post type of values through in PHP using dollar underscore post super global variables so this is a very simple example of dollar uh, underscore post super global variables i hope you understand this concept and may apply to your project in the next tutorial we are going to see dollar underscore uh, request super global variable which is used to access both type of values so where we will see some advanced concepts so thank you very much for watching my tutorials if you like my videos please subscribe